I'm here with Mason Pro of the Bremont Tigers, and I've got a few questions for him. Mason, the Tigers are seven and zero. To what do you contribute that success? Um, coming out to practice every day, working hard, going every week, practicing, and staying together as one team, and just playing hard every Friday night and coming out with the win. What's something you think we need to work on? We just need to we need to do a better job with communication. Who inspires you? My family because um, they they're the ones that push me to, to work hard and they keep me going um, and tell me good job every time I do good and it makes me want to try even harder. Give me one personal goal and one team goal that you have. My personal goal is to have the tie, highest tackle tie, tackle count on the tackle chart. Team goal would be to go out and win state. Okay. Uh, anything else you'd like to say to you Bremont Tiger fans out there? It's going to be a rough game. It's going to be a good game. Come out and support us. Thanks, sir. I'm here with Hunter Stewart of the Bremont Tigers, and I've got a few questions for him. Hunter, the Tigers are 7-0. and To what do you contribute that success? I think our team chemistry this year is the best it's ever been. We are all communicate and we all understand each other really well and we all go out and work hard for what we have. Okay. Uh, what's something that you think we need to work on? I think we need to work on communication across the field and our secondary needs to get better. Okay. Who inspires you? I would have to say Mason Reed and Coach Rebel. Mason Reed because he's just an inspirational athlete. He does his best on and off the field to be a great person. He always shows sportsmanship and He's very disciplined at what he does, and Coach Revel because every day throughout the week he just inspires me to do my greatest, and his motivational speeches each Friday inspire me to go out and play hard. Okay. Uh, give me one personal goal and one team goal that you have. A personal goal for me would be go out and do a lot better than what I did last year, go BL District again, and who knows, maybe even better. And, a uh, team goal, I would have to say, is just go win a state championship. There's nothing else that'll do. Okay. Uh, anything else you want to say to your Bremont Tiger fans out there? Come out and support us. Be Burton tonight. Love to see you there. I'm here with Jarvis Jones, the Bremont Tigers, and I've got a few questions for him. Jarvis, the Tigers are 7-0. and To what do you contribute that success? Hard work and dedication and taking that risk of going too far and finding out how far we can actually go. Okay. What's something that you think we need to work on? Effort. Effort is really important when it comes to practice and games because that um, actually um, let people know how how bad we actually want it. Okay. Who inspires you? Coach Rebel and um, Eric Thomas. Um, both of them are very motivational, um, very inspirational. They um, really pump us up for the games. Okay. Uh, give me one personal goal and one team goal that you have. Well, one of my personal goals is that to be better than the Friday I was before. And our team goal is to be the ones behind the ones who won state championship in 1981 and be state champions. Okay. Uh, anything else you want to say to your Bremont Tiger fans out there? Bring your noise makers and get ready to be loud and proud because tonight's going to be a good game. Come out and support us. All right. Thank you, sir. Like a
Terminator Like Arnold Schwarzenegger Trying to play me out like this if my name was Sega But I ain't going out like no per- Get used to one style AO and I might switch it up Up and around, then buck buck get down Put out your head and then you wake up in the dawn of the dead I'm coming to get ya, I'm coming to get ya Spitting out lyrics, homie I with ya I came to get down, I came to get down So get out your seat and jump around Jump around Jump around Jump up, jump up and 